going on everybody? Of course, my name is Blitzwinger and ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys are having a fan flipping fantastic day. Welcome on back to, of course, another part in the Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare playthrough. Today we are playing once again on the PlayStation 4. Yes, I know, I know what you're saying. Blitzwinger, are you going to go back to the Xbox 360 version? Yes, we will. But I honestly have enjoyed the PS4 version so very, 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 very much that um, I'm having a bit of a hard time going back to the uh, Xbox 360 version. I will, but mm, probably not anytime very, 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 very soon. Nonetheless, of course, today what I would love to do is to be able to play as this fella right here, which is the brand new alien flora. So before we get rocking and rolling, I guess we could go on ahead and get him customized and looking stylish. Ooh. Okay, I kind of like... What's going on here? Oh, there it is. The silver sun mask. That's pretty freaky looking. Let's see. Um. All right, well, the panda set is just too adorable. How could we skip that? <laughs> I like that royal one. Oh, that's awesome. There's the granny set, the flower set, the cat set, and then the panda set. Let's go with the cat set. That looks really, really freaky and cool at the same time. Uh, let's see. Gold buds, diamond cast hands. That looks pretty fancy. The tiki queen set. Um, I guess we could go with that. Everybody loves pie. Ooh, maybe with a creepy clown face. The silver surprised clown. Then we have a silver vine, gold slices, gold exotic swirls, some flower child, the cat set, and then the panda set. Whoa! Okay, that looks awesome, but so does this, honestly. This kind of looks like an evil Garfield. <laughs> All right, let's go with the panda set this round, uh, but then we'll probably switch it up for the other ones as well. So, um, some people were asking for some gardens and graveyards. I would not mind doing that, but the problem is, since we're doing a plant today, I don't really want to play that because, well, playing as a plant is not particularly fun in that game mode, so what I think we're gonna play is, why don't we do a little bit of Taco Bandits? Why not, right? We'll play a little bit of Taco Bandits, uh, and then maybe a uh, Team Vanquish or something like that, because uh, this is a really good character for that. Um, of course, Garden Ops is also a perfect thing to do this, uh, or to use a Sunflower for. I love the, sun, uh, the Sunflower in the Garden Ops mode. I think that's probably my favorite plant to use in um, Garden Ops, if I had to choose. I mean, the pea shooters are awesome, obviously, but I think I prefer the most the Sunflowers. I think they're the best in that regard, but... Um, let's see if we can uh, get a good performance out of the alien flower, which I've never played with, so this is going to be truly my first, first time uh, playing, which will be uh, a first time experience, so I will literally show you guys uh, whether or not the plant is good. Alright, great. Well, that was a good match. <laughs> it's so funny when you just join one, like, as it ends, you're like, oh, well, that was exciting. All right, well, it looks like the zombies were victorious that time. We are, we did earn 2,500 coins, though, so... Hey, I'm not gonna complain about that. That's pretty sweet. Wow, that was a very loud noise. But, uh, what is cool is that uh, since Halloween has passed, they have offered up the Happy Halloween pack still for purchase, so that's pretty cool. So that if you missed out on some of those trick-or-treat days, you can still buy the packs and get things like the Frankenflower, the Bone Teeth, the Scary Hands, the Vampire Eyes, the Boo Outfit. So let's go ahead and snag up a couple of these. That should be pretty fun. Ooh, did you see that, the gorilla? Oh, that looks so cool, the Sam Squanch. <laughs> All right, ain't no sunshine, where are you going? Okay, I shouldn't say that. Uh, Bitey the Bat, uh, Scary Stripes, and Grumpy Stompa. Which sounds pretty fun to say, Grumpy Stompa, Grumpy Stompa. Ooh, okay, we got some really sweet things here. We've got Retro Robo, Batty for the pea shooter this time around, the pea brain, which looks awesome, the Zomsa astronaut, and then some of the pumpkin hands, which look like some, uh, which, sorry, which looks like something that the Green Goblin would definitely love to be using. So, with all that being said, here we are heading off to another round of Taco Bandits, because the first round went so well <laughs> and so quickly that I couldn't even notice how well we did, right? Uh, so it looks like we're going to be heading off to Crash Course at nighttime. So, yeah. This is, uh, this is a good map. I like this map quite a bit. I'm just trying to remember right now where the tacos are on this map. I think they're... Yeah, I think I remember where they are. I'm pretty sure. 
Oh, oh, it's not letting me switch teams. Well, this is, uh, oh, okay. I was going to say this is a bit of a fail, but luckily it let me switch teams just at the very last moment there. All right, so I would really, really want to see what kind of shots the Alien Flower has. Like, actually how it shoots. I've seen, obviously... Ooh, man, that looks so beautiful. Look at that. It's like you're putting on a fireworks show for your enemies. Your enemies should want to be vanquished by you. Because look at that. Like, look at that incredible work you're doing for them. It's really, really brilliant if you think about it. Um, okay, I'm going to put a freezing one down because I like those. Are there any potted plants on this side? Nope, there are not. Okay. So here we go. Whoa, already? Already here? How? How so quickly? Okay, I got one of them. Come on. Wow, it's really cool because you, you can kind of confuse your enemy just by firing off because it feels like they probably can't even tell what's happening half the time. Or at least I wouldn't be surprised if they can't. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, move! Dude! Dude! We gotta take this guy down! Come on, everybody! Okay, sweet, we got him. Looking pretty good right now. Things are coming together nicely. Oh, God. Okay, I should not have gone up that close to him. That was not very smart of me. But I'll be honest, the main reason why I went that way is because I wanted to uh, plant some plants in the uh, pots up ahead there. Because you see, this is what I thought would happen, is that they would come around... Come on, help me out here. Sweet. Man, the alien flower makes this creepy noise. Like, it's like it has this like aura noise to it, which is really interesting. All right, there you go. Heal up. Now, let's see. From what I understand, the shots that I shoot off do damage, uh, do like side damage as well. Like basically, they kind of like explode on the floor, similar to like the jade cactus or something along those lines. So that's pretty cool. I'm gonna put a couple of doom shrooms down, because why not? Seems like a pretty good idea to me. Okie dokes. Oh my god, why did I jump up? To <laughs> that was so terrible! What was I thinking? I just literally went like, oh yeah, wait a minute. Remember how I just got- oh my god, why did I revive myself? I was being picked up. But yeah, that, that was not very smart of me. Come on, Doom Shroom! Help me out here! Oh my god! I am terrible with the flower. I mean, with the alien flower, I should say. This is probably not the best game mode for this, either. Because, again, you do, like you don't get a lot of benefit from healing here. And... Come on! Where'd you go? Oh no, oh no, he's gonna kill me again, watch. I told you! What is wrong with me? If I know he's gonna get me, why do I keep fighting him? <laughs> like, there's no logical thing there. Isn't that the actual definition of crazy? Doing the same thing over and over again, expecting a different result? That's what I was doing just now. I was doing exactly that. Okay, so... There is that guy still back there, so... It would be kind of nice to not have to deal with him. Oh, there he is. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him being all clever and stuff. Aha! We got you. We got you. I like them apples. Oh, okay. I'm guessing the answer is quite a bit. All right, I got a vanquish. And I'm healing people. So I'm doing all that healing stuff, too. Healing plants. Alright, I really don't like the, uh, the scientist class. It's really difficult to deal with. Is there somebody still there? No? Come on! Stay away! Boom, shakalakers! Okie dokes. Come on! Why are they all attacking from that one side? That's kind of a weird strategy. Oh, okay, I guess I, I guess I understand how the alien flower works. Finally, it's about time I would. Uh, but basically, you see this little spore thing? When the enemy stands in them, they take damage from that. So, 
That's how it works. It would be kind of cool to get a flower in the same vein, but one that has healing instead. So, like, you could shoot towards your teammates. And then... Okay, let me reset the taco. Got it. No, I did not. No, I did not. I thought I had it. I was very close to having it. Come on. Woohoo! Got it. Come on. What just happened? What kind of a tackle was that? That was like some sort of truck ran into us. <laughs> that was ridiculous. Wow. Okay. OP much? OP much? Yes. OP very much. Okay. Whoa. I don't even know what just happened. Oh, was that the Doom Shroom that just got both of those guys? I think it might have been. Can I shoot that thing? Okay, I did not pick a great point to be protecting, but on the bright side, it looks like we're about to be victorious, so that's pretty sweet. Come on! Alright, that's it. I think we got this. I think we got this. I don't see them doing anything at this point. 2-1! Victory is ours! Alright, so... Uh, we had a matchup of Taco Bandits, which was fun, but I would like to go ahead and uh, change to Team Vanquish, because I think that I could put together a much better performance if that's the game mode we're dealing with. I'm not 100% sure. I, I might play terribly there as well, so it's definitely not a 100% uh, guarantee type proposition, but I certainly think I could do better. We went 5-5 five and five here, which is, ugh, that's pretty bad. Especially after the last few performances that we had, like where we were going like 3.4 uh, as our KO, uh, Vanquish to KO ratio, I think 2.8. I think we went 15-0 and 0 at one point or something like that, didn't we? 5-0, and 0, or 15-1 and 1, I think, and 5-0, and 0, something along those lines, which was awesome. I think that was with the Jade Cactus, wasn't it? So that was last time. Um, okay, so let's see. Doo -doo 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 -doo. What were we going to do? We're going to play some classic Team Vanquish. Well, not classic Team Vanquish. Regular Team Vanquish. Uh, but that's something that we haven't done in a while now. So I kind of am happy to play just good old Team Vanquish. Without Vanquish confirmed. None of the other objectives to deal with. Just typical good old-fashioned Team Vanquish. A.K.A. of course Team Deathmatch. If that's what you're used to calling it. It's just cool. Um, it's a cool little game mode. And it's uh, it's very classic. So it works. That's that's why it's good. It's good because it works and it's fun and it's cool. Alrighty room. Only problem is again. The PS4 seems to be... Doesn't have as many players as some of the other systems do. Which... It's a little unfortunate, and I hope that it, that changes over time. I hope more and more people join uh, the PS4 community of Plants vs. Zombies. Hard than warfare. Alright, so the cool thing is I can e even shoot stuff ahead of him and then let the Poland do the damage, which is awesome. So that's really cool. So you can kind of change your strategy around that. Oh, come on, heal me! What?! How is he able to heal- it, it, it take me out faster than the healing? That was well done. I mean, that was really, really, really well done. I just don't get how he managed to do that, that's all. Alright, I'm just gonna shoot a whole bunch of Poland. Ooh, I hurt somebody down there. That's kind of interesting. Come here, come here, dude! Dude, I'll heal you. Look at this! It's a healing trifecta over here! Uh oh, I got you. Get up, dude. Get up. Okay, I got one. Oh no. Come on. Got him. Come on. No way. No way. No way. What? Am I lagging? This is ridiculous. I'm playing way too aggressive. I need to be more like a panda. Lay back. Relax. Don't be so aggressive. Because as you can see, my aggressiveness is not paying off whatsoever. Is that a zombie there? What do you think? Oh, oh, oh. There we go. Look at that. That is some lovely damage right there we're gathering up. Okay, I don't get I don't get it. I don't get it. How much health do you have? Okay, finally. I got him. 
All right, so I'm gonna put down some Poland and use that to kind of judge where the enemy is. Oh my God, it's this guy again. It's this dude again. Yes, got him. Not today, my friend. Not today. Like I thought he could do the same thing to me again. It's not gonna happen. Hey, that's kind of a cool healing glitch because you can just constantly heal your own plant as it's getting poisoned. And that way you could be scoring a lot of points. So here we go, just gonna fire off a few of those shots. Oh man! Oh, ooh, that guy's been spiky weeded! Oh my god. If I just stayed there, I would have been able to get him. But that guy snuck up on me. Well done. Well done indeed. There's a healing station right next to me. That's cool. There's a panda and a cheetah hanging out in that uh, kill cam. Okay, dokes. So here we go. Here comes the zombie push. Wow. Okay. A couple rockets flying my face. That's not cool. All right. If I see any of them come up here, if they don't get blown up by the potato mines, I'm going to take them out with my solar beam. And I did purposefully stand right here so that I don't see them. So that, sorry, they can't shoot me easily. So they really do have to walk up here. I'm kind of feeling I'm starting to waste my time here. Now watch, as soon as I stand up, there's going to be somebody here to shoot at. Watch, I, I can almost guarantee that. Come on, get him. Nice. Get up, get up, get up. Oh my god. It's a revive, but not well-timed. Because I basically put my own teammate in trouble. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. I gotta play, I gotta learn how to play this plant better. Because I'm obviously doing something very, very, very... Oh, God. Are you kidding me? Guys, why are we, why are you shooting me? Why are you all staring at me when you should be staring at him? You're getting shot by him, not me. Come on, shoot that guy. Shoot this guy, everybody! Are we losing? Oh no, we're actually winning, which is awesome. So I'm just gonna keep firing away. Because I'm sure that there's some zombies over there. Oh, I see you. Being all sneaky and stuff. Okay, reload. Gotcha. Alright, let's heal you up. So you're good to go. Okie dokes. I'm gonna throw one of these down here. Alright, let me get your health back up. Okay, you seem to need the health the most. Oh, come on! How's the train protecting all the shots? You've gotta be kidding- MOVE! PEOPLE! STOP STANDING IN FRONT OF ME! This is really terrible decision making. Uh-oh. Careful. Just careful. Oh no! Oh! Oh my god, that all-star scared the heck out of me. <laughs> I just heard the shooting and then I turned my head and I see him. Alright, well, I think we still did terribly. So we gotta we gotta try again. We gotta try again. We gotta get a good performance out of the alien flower. Alright, 7-4. That's actually not that bad. So hmm. Okay, maybe I exaggerated that, because it didn't it felt like we were playing terribly, but we actually ended up being second overall. And uh, we went positive with 1.75 as our Vanquish to KO ratio. So that's pretty sweet, actually. I'm really, really happy with that. Uh, let's go ahead and acquire a couple bling bling packs here. While we wait for the next round. <gasps> is that a water... Oh my god, that is amazing. The silver water... Okay, we're putting that on. Silver safety barrel mask. The gold pixel glasses. That's pretty cool. Gold jaggies and some of the diamond grave busters or crave busters. I'm not sure how you pronounce which pronunciation it was there. Or which word it was, sorry. Diamond Pretty Butterfly. The gold test pattern. The gold powdered wig, which is probably the world's heaviest wig on the planet. I mean, uh, that, that kind of looks like Donald Trump, actually. Gold eye spikes and some silver camo goggles, which are pretty cool indeed. So it looks like we can't actually purchase a third pack, so maybe we'll do that 
after this next round is over. Speaking of rounds being over, though, that was the mo- the world's worst transition ever, or segue, I should say. But uh, a lot of you guys were saying that um, you're enjoying the longer format of PVZ right now, so that's why I'm gonna try to make it half an hour long, usually half an hour to 45 minutes long. So I hope you guys will enjoy that. And of course, once again, if you do, please don't forget to thumbs up the video and let me know down in the comment section below if you liked it when it was 20 minutes or if you like it better now when it's a little bit longer or substantially longer, I should say. All right, so uh, let's get rocking and rolling. But before we do that, I'm sorry, but we have to replace these ears because, I mean, the cool... The, oh, man. This watermelon is awesome, too. I love watermelon. But there's a silver water... Okay, we got to go with the silver watermelon. It's just too cool. It's too cool. I mean, look at that. That just looks awesome. All right, here we go. All righty. So this is a really good map for me usually. So I'm hoping that it will be the case for this round. Uh Oh, Oh, where'd you come from? No, no, you don't. No, you don't. You're shooting at my teammate, dude, dude. Dude, stop shooting! Oh my, oh my god, you took my kill, Chester Chomper. Alright, I got you, bro. Throw down a couple of healers. Got you. Uh-oh. Come on, come back here! Don't just walk up in front of the enemy! Alright. Oh, woo! Did I just notice that? Or was that always the case? That it seems like the pollen is actually slowing down the enemies, too. That's kind of interesting. Okie dokes. You've been revived. You see, that's the cool thing about the revives. When you play the plant on Team Vanquish, you can get... Uh, you can score points by reviving people, which is awesome. So, for example, watch this. As soon as I revive this guy, minus one right there on the zombie score. So that's really, really cool. I like that kind of stuff. Pretty awesome. Okie dokes. Okie dokie. Here we go. Here we go. I think there's somebody up here. I could have sworn I heard. Uh oh. Oh no, you don't. No, you don't. Oh man. Oh man. Whoo, that guy could have got me. I don't think that. I think that's a new player. I'm pretty sure. Because they were not playing particularly great. But then again. The more new players, the merrier, because as I always said, the PS4 community is still pretty small, so... I like the fact that there are more and more players joining the game. Okay, so I need to hide because... Well, my health is really low, so... Come on, pick up all that health. Come on. Keep on going. Keep on rocking. Come on. A wee little bit more health. Awesome. And I think we're good to go. Okie dokes. So. Huh. Okay, maybe I imagined the whole thing of uh, the Poland being... uh... Okay, come on. Got him. All right. Oh, man! I thought I could get a revive right there. All right. Well, right now we're in first place, so that's pretty awesome. So we're committing and uh, doing our role, I should say. Or completing our role. Very, very well, I would say. Since we are not just uh, scoring points via vanquishers, but we are also denying the opposing team from points via reviving our teammates. Such as... Isn't there a teammate somewhere around here? Where is this person? Oh, okay, they were in front of me. How could I not see them? Alright, let me heal you up. Okay, you gotta shoot this guy up here. Or this guy down here. I mean, either one works just fine. Okay, let me throw down one of these healers. So we can get our health back up. Oh, come on! Uh Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Careful, careful, careful! Come on! Oh, man! How? Watch! Oh, man. Okay, I thought that that guy was actually gonna come back, which would have really, really irked me the wrong way. 
Okie dokes, careful. Careful, careful, careful. Alright, what is that noise? Why does it sound like there's an all-star underneath us? Okay, maybe they took him out. Maybe there was one. Okay, I feel like I stole that Vanquish. That was not cool! Alright, I think I can go into solar beam mode here. Because I should be able to inflict quite a bit of harm from here. And I think we got another victory! That is awesome! I also got a trophy for the healing touch! You've got the touch! You've got the power! That's that Transformer song. 3,630 coins is what we are rewarded with, which is hopefully enough to keep us in first place. Yes, it is. It is, uh, wow, it's actually quite ahead of uh, everybody else. About 300 points or so. So that's awesome. We went seven and one, so that is all in all a pretty solid performance, if I'm gonna say so myself. And uh, this allows us an opportunity to reward ourselves with a lovely bling bling pack. So we've got the Diamond Tree Stumps. The gold 3D shades, the gold fume shroom cap, gold nerd glasses, and some silver banana hands, which is not something you expect to say ever. <laughs> it's like, hey, what's up, dude? Silver banana hands. Oh my god, look at that. That looks awesome. The gold hazard mouth, the golf <laughs> gold golf glove. Goodness gracious, that's hard to say. Say that quickly five times. The silver cactus wrap and the silver splash glasses. All right, so I should be able to get another pack real quick here. Oh, I bought Legends of the Lawn by mistake. My bad. Ooh, look at that. That's a bit of a preview for the next character that we're going to play as. Uh, we have P cannon set, the heal zombies, and some basketball sets. So you can go ahead and dunk on that. Boom shakalaka. That was a terrible pun. All right, so here we go. One more round of Team Vanquish. Let's see what map we will be given. The Zomboss Estate. I love this map, so... Huh. Actually, I'm not sure if I love this map with the flower. Because, you see, this is one of those maps that... Oh, there's not a lot of, like, open spaces. Like, th like, for example, right here, the picture we're looking at, like, where that zombie hand statue is coming up from the ground, that's really, like, the only space that is, like, really, really open. Everything else is very hills, and there's a lot of objects in the way, so... I'm not sure how well I'll play this time around. Because if you haven't noticed, the flower is not a particularly agile class. It's a lot more of a, obviously, support class. That's what it's meant for. It's the medic class of the game. So, typically, what I would love to do is stick next to somebody like that, like a pea shooter, who is an aggressive class, and then just kind of provide a lot of support. All right, let me try to throw down a whole bunch of pollen. Have this guy walk into that, which would be awesome. Oh, I see him. Right there. So hopefully my pollen can hurt him. So at least I'm scoring some points from the healing, so that's awesome. There you go, bud. Uh-oh, watch out. Watch out, we gotta engage right here. This guy is chasing our teammate! He's gonna take down our teammate! How dare he? That was just rude, dude. Come on! Uh-oh, come on, reload. Uh oh oh, uh oh I'm getting shot, I'm getting shot, I'm getting shot! Oh man! I thought I could sneak back. Why did I only earn 45 points? How's that possible? If I've got a vanquish, or did I get an assist on that? I must have got an assist, because there's no way I would have 45 points otherwise. Okay, well our team is, uh, is not doing great right now. We're behind uh, quite a bit already. Wow. Okay, OP much? This is the problem. It's really, really tough to win a one-on-one -on -one firefight with a strong class like that, like the Engineer. So... I'm trying to not get myself into those types of situations by sticking next to somebody more powerful, like this Chomper, for example. I'm gonna try to get in close. Or next to. Come on. Uh-oh. Wowzers. That was pretty powerful. Okay, I got you, bro. Come on! Gotcha. Alright, got a dual vanquish streak going. No, 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 no. Why would you? 
Move! Wow, how did he dodge all of that? That is mind-boggling. Wow, that was super impressive. Is he reviving this guy? Okay, that was pretty easy. I don't know why he didn't revive him to begin with. But this is a good way for us to um, avoid the plants from scoring. Because it looks like we pulled ahead now. We were behind, but not any longer. Oh, if I could have just got at least one more revive, that would have been nice. Unfortunately, that was not the case. I was gold gaddling in the face. Sorry, my mic got really loud there for a moment. I apologize for that, my friends. Okay, okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I see you. It's so awkward because for some reason it feels like I don't hit the uh, what I'm aiming. Like I have to kind of like aim ahead of my target with this guy. It's really weird. Like I can't really explain it unless if you're playing it. You won't really understand what I mean. Uh, maybe I kind of verbalized it somewhat well there, I'm not sure. Not 100% certain on that. Oh god, okay, he's got the multi-rocket. Which is very, very, very dangerous. No! Okay, I got the revive there, get up, get up, get up. Okay, come back here. I need you back here, dude. I need you back here. Okay, we're looking pretty spiffy. Okay, okay, okay. There's a zombie. Oh, huh. wow. Okay, well this is not working out. Because what I wanted to do there is to create a lot of pollen and then use that to create damage. You see, right there. That's what I'm talking about. I was doing some pretty good harm. I also don't like that my critical hit only does 13 points of damage. Like, that's very, very low. But I shouldn't be complaining, because we're ahead by 5 points right now, so... Oh! Okay, this is really bad. This is the one class I do not want to be seeing. Oh, man! And that's why, because it's really tough to deal with it. Ugh, that's really, really tough, man. Oh, oh, he was being revived! I gotta stop doing that! They've evened out the score, by the way, which is terrible. Yeah, I gotcha. Come on. No, you don't. That guy's reviving everybody. This is bad. Oh. Oh, my googly moogly. Okay, let me heal you. Okay, stay, 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 stay. I got you. Don't revive yet. I got you. I got you both. Come on. Reload quicker. Why so slow? Oh, <laughs> if I could have just reloaded just a tiny little bit quicker, that would have been terrific. All right, I'm going to be revived. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, this is bad. Oh, I'm taking a lot of damage. Oh my god! I feel like I'm so slow, I'm so sluggish! Man, it, it's really frustrating. Because you do feel like, with the plant, I mean, well, in general, I've said it before and I'll say it again, I think that the plants are, uh, by far, the least uh, interesting characters to play as. Like, and what I mean by that is, like, competitively. Like, if you want to get a lot of vanquishes, or even be, like, really, really high scoring, it's much more difficult to do so with a plant than it is with a... With a zombie. That doesn't mean that it's not possible. I'm just saying that with the zombies, it's way easier. And the zombies just have a much more diverse playstyle, much more quicker uh, playstyle. So I'm hoping that maybe with some upgrades and stuff, they could patch. Um, and I don't think that the zombies need to be nerfed. I just think that a lot of the plants could be buffed. Especially like the cactuses. Some of the pea shooters should be brought back to what they were at. Like the law pea and the... Um, Agent P, I think, should be back what they were. Whatever those stats are that they uh, minimized not too long ago. Gotcha. Alright, there's a couple of revives back here. Because they're sneaking up behind us, which is pretty clever. 
being all clever rascals and stuff. Gotcha. Oh, okay, well, I guess I'm not getting a revive here. Oh, dual healing! Look at us! This is dual-ception. Healing-ception, I should say. Oh, watch out, watch out, watch out. Get him, get him, get him, get him! Where'd he go? Wow, it's so confusing! I can't tell what's happening! All my teammates are down, though! I don't understand how that's possible. I don't understand how <laughs> he appears, and then all my teammates are gone. That was crazy. I think the zombies won. Oh, man. That was close, but that last moment, that last encounter against that scientist, it was insane. He appeared and he took out everybody. Well, at least we got a whole bunch of honors, so that's awesome. We got the heal master honors, we got the assist master honors, and we have the revival master honors, so that's not too bad. We went six and six, but we did go ahead and get 14 assists, which is very, very good. Seven revives, which again, you could kind of count, especially in Team Vanquish, as part of your regular points. So technically speaking, it's almost like we went 13 and six, because, well, we... Those seven points count as negative points for the zombies, so that's very, very good stuff indeed. And, uh, yeah, okay, so let's do one more round here. Uh, let's buy another Halloween pack, why not? Ooh, that's a cool mask there, I like that. Okay, so I think we are probably got everything at this point. Let's try one more. If we only get consumables, that's a sign that, yeah, you see, now we've got everything that there is to get, so... If you get a pack like that, that means you've got all the other collectibles that you can possibly get uh, from the Halloween theme, of course. Now, what I'm hoping for is that Christmas time we get Christmas stuff, because as much as Halloween is awesome, and I do like Halloween, and it's a fantastic holiday, I love Christmas, so I really hope we get, like, you know, Santa Claus outfits and stuff like that. <laughs> Alrighty, guys, my apologies about this interruption in the video. Well, it's actually kind of the conclusion of the video. So as I was sitting here about to edit and uh, chop up this video, I realized, hey, wait a minute, there's a little bit of a problem here. And that is, of course, the fact that the last round in this episode got corrupted. So my apologies about that. You still get a nice lengthy episode of PvZ Garden Warfare, but unfortunately I was not able to rescue the final round here so I do want to apologize for that that being said of course I hope that you guys still enjoyed this episode right here of PVZ Garden Warfare if you did please hit that like button share the video with your family and friends favorite the videos as well we'll be back to hopefully a nice normal interruption free episode next time so thank you guys so very much for watching as always guys have a fan fantastic day my apologies once again and I'll see you later alligators bye bye guys